can't use fast charge and then uses his station warriors to destroy it. That mm. would be beautiful. Yeah, <laughs> that would be just. But he needs everything to go in his favor. Yeah, I yeah. did. I did that against Happy Souls um, a few times, and it was absolutely beautiful. Just <laughs> two noble horse and four heavy horse straight up the center. Uh, turn off Ariovistus with the Intimidate, and Swevi just crapped itself. Because, I mean, I've been pretty lax with the cavalry rules, so that people can bring some more. I we can bring. Yeah. During the, uh, under the current rules, I see no reason to have, like, a 8 max cavalry total. That makes no sense. Yeah, I mean, that's oh. why it's 8, ca eight max cavalry with 4 uh, yeah. horse archers. That so. makes more sense, yeah. And horse archers, I mean, 4 horse archers, that's fine. Um... <laughs> Even uh, yeah, I don't think it's yeah. They're so uh, easy to one. just zone out of the battle with a few cheap units. Once you get eight, yeah, then <laughs> things start to suck. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hello, Agony Vincent. He's now in chat, and Jonas Lee. This, I mean, wow. Oh wow, happy souls. Oh, okay. Very happy souls. Oh, I like happy souls build. Uh, I mean, yeah, it's. I don't know. There's just so much. <laughs> There's just so. Wow. I'm kind of surprised as to why he decided. Oh, okay, okay, that makes sense. Okay, yeah, yep. I like it. Yep, I like his build. Yes, this. You remember th this is what I was talking about with Tyler's uh, in one of the first games. This type of setup. Uh, yeah, the Celtic. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's just. Yeah, we'll see how he makes it work. But if he gets his charges, then. Ouch. Ariovistus for Atheus, of course. Oh, thank God. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> imagine, imagine. And uh, Commander General for... That oh, kind of makes so sense when you have uh, 45, uh, 45 and 50 morale. The Commander is not a bad choice. True. Still, would have liked to see the... Uh, the Warrior. That's a very ballsy uh, General choice. Yeah. Much safer to go with this, I guess. It is. Although not as effective, not nearly as effective. No. Because if your men are wavering and about to break, that usually means that a shitload of them have died. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But still, having Thracian warriors stay in the fight for a bit longer can be massive. Alright, they are ready. Alright, nice. And yeah, we are so going. Who wants to go with the bullet? Uh, you guys can go, I guess. Happy Souls okay. has uh, six Gallo or five Gallo Thracians, five Gallo Thracians, uh, three Oathsorn, six Thracian Warriors, six Celtic Warriors. Just melee spam. Whoa. <laughs> yeah. Whoa. Celtic Warriors up front, first line Celtic Warriors, second line Thracian, third line those mid tier and uh, elite tier infantry. This setup is <laughs> just, uh, yeah, it's. And Atheus, on the other hand, has gone for a just super massive, straight up barbarian melee infantry. <laughs> just one huge line. I think he's got berserkers up in the center. That's what that's what would be a smart move. Uh, berserkers with some wolf warriors. Yeah, four berserkers, a uh, couple of wolf warriors just behind, uh, just in front of his noble riders general, uh, with another noble riders uh, besides them. He's obviously going to pop fast charge, which will affect his uh, his berserkers and his uh, wolf warriors. And then he's got some uh, some more wolf warriors, some more bloodsworn on the flanks, just to hold out the enemy troops. I would imagine. And of course, three Germanic scout riders, whereas Tullus doesn't have any raiding horse. Yeah, again, no raiding horse. And what's crazy is it's uh, the entire engagement is going to be fought in the forest, so. Uh, Swaby's huge charge bonus will actually be diminished by the yep. trees that are over there. Hmm. But will be interesting. Since Happy Souls went for three lines, I mean, sure, the charge will break through 
the first line, but how, is, is he gonna be able to have enough staying power to beat the other lines? He has Plus. the o he has three Oathsorn and uh, and the yeah. five Galothrations, and that is more than enough. When yeah. these when Swevi breaks through the Celtic warriors, they're going to get Thracian warriors in the face, and there's yes. not going to be a whole lot of Swevi left. And the way he's moving up by the river here means that he is not going to be outflanked very easily yeah. by the Swevi lines. It all depends on timing, I think. Yeah, absolutely. If, if the, his uh, Atheus has already got two Germanic scout riders to the rear. If he can get a chain snipe, get at least a lot of kills on this also, which is possible. Yep. Uh, and then some flaming shot with some rear charges from Germanic scout riders. Could, could be enough. But javelins, just turn around and throw the damn javelins. Few javelins incoming. Oh yeah, massacre, absolute massacre. Oh my god, they just lost 30 units. Oh yeah, and they are already, they are already winded. So they're going to be super slow in this forest here. Smartly using his Celtic warriors to just zone out the Germanic scout riders. It's going to be very, very, very difficult for uh, Atheus to pull this off. Yeah, yeah. It's a very smart uh, army. You can see already Atheus is again out of position with his le left flank. Happy Soul seems to do this very well. Like, yeah, he's he very aware of that. And then rotates right. Yeah. yeah. And, and uh, one thing I've seen Atheus do is he always deploys to one side of the, of the map. He always seems to do that. Which, I mean, I guess it works. It doesn't work in his favor sometimes. So I think yeah. this is one of those times. Now he has to move up to mirror the but but he can get outflanked while uh, while happy happy souls can't really get outflanked here. Yeah, it's yeah. gonna be tough for tough for happy to get uh, outflanked. Yeah, they have to cross through some trees and then shallow water <laughs> and then rear charge. But one one massive uh, liability for for although his army is super strong, happy souls morale is a huge liability. Because that's, what, that's the 45 morale from yeah. the Thracian warriors, uh, Celtic warriors, you know, and uh, even Galothracian, they only have 50, so yeah. not, not very strong. Chain route can be a very uh, real consequence of bringing this type of build. Absolutely. So if he gets charged, if he starts losing the combat, and then there are fair units, then that could be it for a lot of these units. Oh, but Atheus' is Germanic scout got yeah, oh, another jab into the face. Major miss micro there again. Celtic warriors being super useful here. Yeah, he's moving really far in front with the Celtic warriors. He can probably probably doesn't need to do that. Maybe these club level can engage them initially. Yeah. Maybe he just wants to have the speed bump there in case Ariovistus hits. But Ariovistus isn't going to be uh, hitting a lot of units here. It's going to be hitting the berserkers in the center and the wolf warriors. Yeah. Which is, I mean, more than enough to be honest. Yeah. I mean, Berserkers and Wolf Warriors will <laughs> make up at yeah. least 400, 500 kills if, yeah. I mean, in total, if they get frenzy and headhunt off. Yeah, absolutely. I think uh, FDS should also use his lines like two, two ranks deep or something. Yeah, he can do that now because Happy Source is doing it. So. Oh, here it comes. Celtics so going to destroy the uh, Club Levy. The Club Levy do not get charges. One of them do, uh, do get charges, but they're going to get wrecked. Fast charge activated, but a bit too soon, I think. Yeah, too soon. They don't have, uh, the, they don't have the charge bonus. Yeah, they don't have it yet, but the infantry is going to get the charge bonus. But the general, look at the general, the noble rider general here. The morale of the Thracian warriors is already in the red because they turned around. The Thracian Warriors didn't get a charge off. He's Ooh, following the uh, rally. Huge but mistakes by Atheus here. No charge bonus at all on this side for Atheus. His right flank. The Berserkers be are he going needs, Berserk. Needs Germanic scout riders. Oh, he's, he's moving in with the Germanic Scouts. This could be pretty... Rare pretty charge pretty plus flaming. Yes, that could be more than enough. He can completely abandon his flanks if he can get that uh, yep. combo done. Noble Rider is trying to die here. General with only 42 men. But um, both are getting slaughtered by, by Club Levy. By yep. Club. <laughs> <laughs> and the I, it just, Atheus the got the best of this engagement by far. Um, yeah. Happy So started moving a back a bit and then he started moving forward. He didn't get his charges and now his units are getting absolutely destroyed he by he the. He shouldn't be rear charging on the flanks though, he should be rear charging up in the center. Yep. But I still think Atheus. Atheus has got this. Yeah, I think so. 
Well, I'm not sure about it though. Well, he is doing very well in the center, and the morale of these units might just... It depends on if the Berserkers can get enough kills in the center here. Uh, it always Please looks it. it always looks really good for Swebby in the beginning, and then they, they just start mm. dying. Yeah. I, I, he hasn't used a headhunt on his Berserkers either. It's yeah. really big. Could be using it right about now. Still some old Sorns remaining, so they might be able to tank it out. On the but on the flank, <laughs> Atheus is just overpowering. Massively on the flanks. And when he starts piling these units in, the morale of these Thracian warriors is going to go down the yeah, toilet. He needed to have done this a long time yeah. ago, actually. He shouldn't have focused on the flanks at all. Okay, Berserkers. Still still no headhunt on the Berserkers. And only 13 units left. <laughs> also near with 90. Also in general with 91 units. But the morale penalty is really starting to take its toll. Yeah. Berserkers still going berserk with 52 men remaining in the unit. That is huge. Oathshorn getting spanked. But the general, most important unit, general is actually doing quite well. Yeah. Your club levy not doing well against station warriors, obviously. Oathshorn over here, obviously, going to win against the wolf warriors. He didn't use frenzy. That's another big thing that uh, Thirst didn't really do. He didn't use frenzy or head on, on any of his units. Yeah. There is so much Webby left on the field and so little, uh, yeah, so little Tylus. Happy Souls again, not using Frenzy, uh, not not using. Uh, oh no, never mind. He's actually Commander this time. Yeah, yeah he's, right. He's used Commander. Right. And he actually popped the rally pretty. Uh, I mean, he he popped it. He popped it at the right time, I think. Yeah, because he was getting. Again, uh, it's not a very useful ability. I think it's a safe ability, but not very effective. Yeah. Ooh, Ooh noble, riders. noble riders went down to a significant degree. That was yeah. huge. Uh, I and think the berserkers it's are running away from the from the now because they're berserk. They're yeah, they're just following. Uh, they're following uh, Thracian warriors that are routing. I think it's over. Yep. So the pilots won. Yep. Oh, only 13 units left in the general. They uh, took another volley. Only 11 units left. Atheos ignored the center and that cost him the game. He did yeah, not need yep. to win this flank. He just would have needed to win the center. And he needed to have used Flaming Shot and got some proper rear charges on the, yeah. on the units that mattered most and used Headhunt on his Berserkers. How did he? And no Frenzy. He, and he again, imagine imagine some Kimbi Bowerman pouring the fire into yep. the uh, Oathsorn and to the, uh, to the, um, to the Thracians. Could have easily killed a ton of them. Yeah. And again, given them that flexibility that Swaby really need, I mean, they're, they're a one trick pony. Might as well bring, like, uh, a Kimbri Bowman to, you know, make them not so much reliant on their charge. Absolutely. So, yeah. <laughs> Some nice kills okay. on the units, but I think the Wolf Warriors were mismanaged to a significant degree. And the the Thracians yeah. should never be allowed to do this well. And one of the ways to do that is to have the uh, is to have at least some skirmishers. I I, I don't even just having two Kimbri Bow women could have been massive in this instance. But this means we will get a third game, which is great. Yes. Whoa. Nice.